Hello guys, my name is Laika and as usual I'm here to provide you with information on how you can become financially independent. It's not always about how you can immigrate, how you can get your visa and all that. I also like to make sure that you are financially stable wherever you are just now because bills still have to be paid and it can't happen with you looking for a visa, looking for a job and nothing is coming your way. So when I speak about these things, it's because I have experienced them myself. You will not find a video like this anywhere else because I speak to you about my own personal experience. When I was pregnant, I did not have any sort of income coming my way. I wanted to get a job. I could not get it. I had a degree and no one was able to employ me because I did not have experience and I could not get experience without employment. I'm sure if you're listening to this, you've probably been part of this cycle. It's a vicious and unending cycle. So what I did was I started working online and I opened an account. I was writing, 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 and eventually I was able to make up to 10,000 shillings a week. Now my, my rent was something about 15,000. So I was able to cover that. I was able to buy food. The reason I was making 10,000 a week is because I was not able to actually write a lot. And it was a starter account, which was earning about a dollar for an article. Sometimes I'll get $2 and it would go, it, it went on uh, rising, but then being pregnant and using a laptop and placing it on my big stomach, sometimes the baby would kick off the laptop. I would be very, very tired when you're pregnant, the hormones and all that, you know, like you're feeling loose and you're feeling tired. I was not able to write a lot, but if you're not in this kind of position, you're able to actually take on more. So let me speak to you about how you can become a transcri transcriber online. So you make money by logging into these websites and you actually type what you hear the people saying. So this is usually for things like voicemails. Um, people can decide to tell you to, to transcribe a whole meeting. So it's been recorded on audio and then they send it to you and what you do is you listen to what they're saying so you would have your headphones in and you type you need to be very very quickly at typing because that means you're, you're going to be able to earn more and you're going to be sent more work so if you get a good client please make sure that you do your best and then you know keep on growing keep on growing find a website that works best for you because i'm going to give you a few options some of them unfortunately do not allow africans and i've not been able to like take my time and go in and sort of like look as i used to i just found the websites that have the transcribing jobs i know some of them don't even advertise to africans they don't even uh, let you see that they actually offer the job because i think maybe they think our education level is not as good but then when they see you work and they see that the job is good then they're going to be able to give you more work we shouldn't give up just because some people have, have not been exposed to africans and uh, don't know that we can actually do these things so if you do find a website and it does not allow you to work from kenya or from tanzania or from africa i would urge you to do this try the vpn option but before you work before you do any job check how they pay, check how much they pay as their lowest. You know, if it's something like $20 or 20 pounds, then that's okay. But if they tell you that you have to earn around a hundred, it might take you a very long time for you to get to that amount, especially as a beginner. Another thing is, please check their mode of payment. If it's PayPal, then you're okay. Okay, I don't know if Tanzania has PayPal. I know Kenya does. Sometime back, my friend in Tanzania couldn't access PayPal and she said it's not there. I don't know if it's there now. But um, if, you're, if you're in Kenya, PayPal can work. But then if they do require a home address from the United States and they need you to have a bank account from the United States or from the UK, unless you have someone who can help you collect the payment, um, I would urge you not to try with that website because your money can easily get stuck in a website. It's happened to me. I opened an account. They said you can put in um, your payment details later. And I thought, okay, let me just work. My money will not get lost. But the money got caught up in the website and I've never been able to access it. I think it's like, it was like $35. To me, that was a lot of money. Another thing to note is that most, most of these websites tell you not to take it as a job that's going to replace your full-time job. They say that you only do it as a part-time job. But when you're from Africa and the 
the rent is not very high let's say for example your rent is 3500 shillings this is money that you can make in an hour transcribing because you can make up to ten dollars to thirty five dollars an hour it just depends on the amount of uh work that you can do in that hour and how well the client is paying i would not encourage you to sort of like turn down work that is low paying because you also need experience everyone likes to have people with experience working for them i don't know no one wants to give the beginners a chance but anyway yeah so just um keep that in mind that if you're from africa and this is actually paying you well save your money invest it well and keep on trying to find work that is going to be more permanent i would not encourage you to actually go and take it on as a full-time thing that you're going you're not going to be able to do something else but if you do not have the option it is a very very good opportunity for you to be able to earn money and to be able to keep applying for work if you don't find the work you still have the money okay so let's talk about these websites because i don't want to keep you here for long i want just 10 minutes and in those 10 minutes i can be able to change your life please remember to share my videos to your social media channels because that's the only way you can help me to also make my time worthwhile i've got this program running that i, I would like to sponsor someone with their ielts if you would like to travel and you cannot afford your ielts i would like to sponsor you but what i need you to do is i need you to share the video to your social media channels if you have a lot of engagement on the video for example you have a lot of likes or people come across and subscribe and um you have a lot of comments on it then take a screenshot and send it to me on my instagram at like as new life yeah and then i'm going to shortlist your name sometimes i do these draws for the week where i send people you know like some lunch or something like that i've not done it for a few weeks but yeah just to help the channel grow and i don't want you to be um helping me when i'm not doing something in return that's not my my motto <laughs> that's not yeah so please uh if you can subscribe share um do all that you can do it to help or if you would like to enter into the draw please share and then ask your friends to like ask your friends to subscribe and then we can help each other because i would like to be able to create this content for you for years so that we all benefit and we learn every day what is transcribing or transcription this is a job that does not require a lot of experience what it needs is someone who is able to focus and type that's all you need another thing to note is transcribing is very different from captioning so transcribing means you're just typing everything you're hearing but captioning means for example when you see my when i speak and then the words are appearing it it just it's just um that's captioning it's it types exactly what i'm saying but if it was transcribing the person would be saying gestures because i'm gesturing as i speak so you literally translate or put down all thought from a video to text so you you would type things like walks to the door bangs it says this and that you see that's transcribing but captioning literally you just type what is being said so that's the difference between the two if you would like to learn more on how you can make your money being a transcriber come with me <music>
one of the biggest sources of transcribing jobs is Rev. If you ask anyone who's worked online and they've done transcribing, they've probably been through this website. It's called REV. The second one is Transcribe Me. Now this one gets you like $15 to $20 an hour. To me, that is very good money, even where I am just now. That is very good money. If you can spend six hours or 10 hours of your day doing the transcriptioning or transcribing, then you're going to be to be earning more than probably someone who's got a degree and is working in an office. And I think that's very good. The other one that you can try is Tigerfish. You can also try Crowdsurf or speak right. I don't want to overwhelm you with a lot of um, websites that you should use, but I would like to give you the basics. And then as you go and um, log into these and as you go and you type in your information, you're going to be getting more suggestions. And that's what I always like about these things. They always suggest, they link you back, they give you an advert that takes you somewhere, but don't click on a virus. <laughs> There's also bubble type, eScribers, three play media, there's also Way With Words, Transcription Pioneer Services, Cambridge Transcriptions, Daily Transcriptions, SpeechPad, and last but not least, GMR Transcription. Now, it is, it is not an easy job because it requires you to really concentrate and pay attention. If you're not good at that, this may not be the job for you. It's also, uh, it takes a lot of time to build up, to become a very good transcriber because the typing and the listening has to go hand in hand. It's not like something that you're going to be um, guessing. It's not like guesswork. It has to literally be what you're hearing. You have to be typing it down. So it takes a lot of concentration, a lot of practice. So as much as it, to, it might sound easy to you, please take it very seriously. And if you're looking for a way to work from home, this is obviously one of the best options for you to try. So best of luck guys. And I'll see you in my next video about amazing careers or about how to work from home. I've got lots, lots more. It's just, as I always say, it's just about time. So please remember to subscribe, share, like, and yeah, this is Laika checking out. Bye-bye.